Let's say hi. <laughs> That's right. Hi, my name is Bobby Joe. I'm six months post-op, six months, two weeks. Um, had surgery January 7th of this year. Um, I had it because my boss also had it, and she talked me into it. <laughs> she didn't have to talk very hard, though. And um, I've lost 73 pounds. I've lost 43 inches total. <laughs> and uh, I feel really good. I haven't had any complications either. Um, there's been a couple times I thought I could eat something, and I didn't really call it a dumping. I just got really nauseous. That's but that jumping. goes goes away, you know, just give it 20, 30 minutes, um, which was uh, sugar. I thought I could have some, just a little bit of ice cream, but I could not do that. Probably in a year you could have, maybe a little taste. A little. Yeah, not yeah. too much, though. But dairy doesn't help much. No, dairy No, I, I have a little bit of problems, mostly just with milk. Cheese seems to be okay, a little bit, you know, sour cream seems to be okay, but like just milk itself, I still have... If have I you tried the acidophilus like, milk, the lactose-free? No. The lactose-free milk often works. Most of our patients get lactose intolerance or lactase insufficiency, and milk without the sugar in it is called lactose-free milk, and oftentimes little bits of that doesn't upset your stomach. Interestingly, in lactose intolerant patients, even though there is some lactose in yogurt, it's often good for the gut to have some of that sour milk. It's good for your gut. So we recommend that if you can, if you can stomach it along with your green tea. <laughs> and, um, but other than that, I've been, like I said, I haven't had, I ne uh, haven't had any you know, vomiting, haven't had any problems with that. Um, but I read on the pulse all the time and what people say and eat small bites a little at a time, sip, sip, sip. And so I just really paid attention to that. Only, uh, you know, f at first it probably took me about 20 minutes to a half an hour to eat my meal. I just took it really slow, put my spoon down, my fork down, whatever, in between each bite. And that seemed to help, so I'm pretty excited about that because I've heard, you know, horror stories. Mm -hmm. And uh, other than that, I feel great. Um, this is the thinnest I've been in 20 years. <laughs> Almost up to my high school graduating weight, and I have about another 30 really like to be about another 40 pounds, but I'll be really happy with 30, so. Good. Congratulations. Thank you very much.